Hi everyone, welcome back to Jamrock TV. Today we're gonna make a nice dish. We're gonna make garlic prawn pasta. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do, some garlic prawn pasta. So we already have our prawns, we have our pasta, you know, our seasoning, we have everything that we're gonna need. So I'm not gonna do a lot of talking today, I'm just gonna explain while I'm doing the cooking, what I'm going to do, alright, and what we're going to use, but as always, I'm going to leave the recipe, everything that I use in the description. So guys, welcome back, so we're ready to start the, pro the cooking process of our pasta, but as you can see, I've already, um, I've gone ahead and I've had my water boiling, I've had some olive oil just so the pasta doesn't stick together because it's when it's cooking so I'm just gonna go add my pasta to the boiling water in order for it to cook and I'm using um, tagliatelle pasta Just wanna see get a nice little something different, you know. So it's not the same as um regular pasta that we cook every day. So just trying to mix it up, give it a bit of twist, my little twist to it. Yeah. Yeah, I think that should be uh, one more. That should be enough. Alright, so we're gonna leave this to cook and then we're gonna prepare our prawns and then cook our prawns. Hopefully, by the time we finish cooking, preparing and cooking our prawns, the pasta should be finished and then we can just get into making the pasta. Alright, so without further ado, let's get into seasoning our prawns and cooking our prawns so guys without further ado we're gonna season our prawns so I'm gonna start by using some garlic powder a generous amount because it is garlic prawns after all yeah I'm gonna add a bit of uh, ginger powder not a, not a lot just a bit Just gonna give that a little, a little stir. Yeah. Gonna add a bit of um, stuff for everyday season. It's a pinch. Not too much. Then I'm gonna just add that in. Just a bit of added flavor. Yeah, so once I add that, I'm just gonna add just a bit of um, minced garlic because you, know, you need some fresh garlic as well, which I'm gonna add it in the pot once the pot is ready to to get going All right. so that's pretty much it to be honest with you for the hi guys so welcome back so I've already put my preheat my arm up and so what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna introduce my butter you know? I'm gonna introduce my butter turn it down 
Nana Nam Low Heat Intergroup Mabata Ya At this time I'm using um, Gold Seal Margarine You know This is not a sponsored video Just to let you guys know I purchased everything myself I'm gonna go ahead now and add some more some more garlic powder yeah and just a touch of ginger up to medium So at this point now I'm just going to add some fresh garlic mm -hmm. Some fresh chopped garlic To the mix I'm just going to just saute that while it locks all of the flavour in Ooh, that's nice so I'm going to turn it on low heat again While my garlic See you So at this point I'm just going to go ahead and add my prawns now I'm just going to add pepper just, just to get some flavor in it so At this point I'm going to turn my heat back up to medium Into the side now, we're gonna go ahead and add um, gonna add my three peppers. So, I'm using the same butter that was that was left inside there. Alright, put it on medium meat. I love it. 
dream time. The flavor. Mm, wow, well, you can smell all of that flavor right now, guys. So, I mean, you can use whatever milk of your choice because I'm going to make, I'm going to use using some, some skim milk but you can use double cream, you can use full fat milk, it's up to you. I'm going to use dairy free, free. so I'm just going to go ahead and pour some milk inside there. Just gonna move gently. So I'm gonna put this on a high heat because I wanna reduce the milk a bit, thicken it. But while I'm doing this, I'm just giving it a stir. So wow. Guys, if you're new to my channel, you need to go ahead and subscribe now. Click that notification bell, select all, so you are updated whenever time I post a new video. And head on over to my um, playlist, or just go ahead and just watch the rest of my videos. Once you're on the channel, just head on over and watch the rest of the videos and then, you know, give yourself, get yourself familiar with the channel and what we do. Next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to add my cheese sauce, which I'm using, um, I'm using cheddar cheese sauce, so I'm just going to and that while I'm stirring. You wanna just continue stirring it so it thickens and it doesn't form too much. So at this point you wanna put it on low heat so it doesn't form too much lump inside there. Mm. That rich creamy texture. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a bit more milk. Because at this point it's a bit too thick for me. So I'm just gonna add a bit more milk to it. I mean you can just use normal cheese if you like, it's up to you, what cheese do you want to use, I'm just using the cheddar cheese sauce, so I'm just going to go ahead now and add my pasta to the mix. I'm just gonna just slowly incorporate everything. So I'll keep it on a low heat while you're doing this. I'm going to 
gonna add my prawns. And then I'll just slowly mix it in again. At this point, guys, should be about finished and ready to play. All right. So there you have it, guys. The prawn, garlic prawn pasta. All right. So it's sim really simple, easy. Not too much. I'll just turn it off. Now, it doesn't take a lot of time to cook. So, I'll see you guys in a bit when I'm gonna play 